Ruby Frankie was sentenced today and the prosecution felt it necessary that everyone in the courtroom, including the judge, revisited everything she had done to her children. The state respectfully requests that the court sentence Ms. Frankie to consecutive prison terms for each of the four counts of aggravated child abuse. This sentence was agreed to by Ms. Frankie in her plea agreement and is also recommended by adult probation and parole. She committed horrible acts of child abuse. From May to August in 2023, Ms. Frankie and her business partner held her two children, ages 9 and 11, turning 12, in a concentration camp-like setting. The children were regularly denied food, water, beds to sleep in, and virtually all forms of entertainment. They were isolated from others and were hidden when people came to visit the house where the children and the defendants were staying. The children were forced to do physical tasks, like carrying loaded boxes up and down stairs and wall sits or sitting against a wall without a chair or a stool for hours at a time. They were also forced to do manual labor outdoors in the extreme summer heat, at times without shoes or socks. They were forced to stand outside on a cement patio in the summer heat for hours and even days at a time. They were beaten and the 12 year old was regularly bound hand and foot after he attempted to run away in mid-July. Both children had extensive physical injuries from the abuse that required hospitalization when they were found. The injuries from the binding to the 12 year old are particularly awful. In addition to physical abuse, the children were emotionally abused to the extent that each believed to some degree that they deserved what was being done to them. Had the older of the children not had the courage to run away and ask a neighbor to call the police, heaven only knows how much longer he could have survived in that situation.